If your Xbox One console can't seem to connect to Wi-Fi or wireless network, there's a set of troubleshooting steps that you must do in order to narrow down the causes. This video might help if you have any of these problems in your console. 1. Can't detect your own wireless network and 2. Can't see any wireless network. To fix your Xbox One Wi-Fi problem, try these solutions. First, can your Xbox One console detect other Wi-Fi or wireless networks? If yes, then you'll have to focus your troubleshooting in your own wireless network. If your console can't see any other wireless networks, it's possible that its wireless adapter may be damaged or not working. It's also possible that your Xbox One has a software glitch that causes wireless functionality to go haywire. A complete power cycle may sometimes help in fixing console network troubles. To do that, make sure to unplug the power cable from the back of your modem or router for about 5 minutes. Afterwards, try restarting the console. To do that, just press and hold the Xbox button in the console for about 10 seconds. Once the console has powered down, press the Xbox button again to turn it back on. Alternatively, you can unplug the power cable from the back and wait for 10 seconds. Afterwards, reconnect the cable and turn on the device. After 5 minutes, reconnect the power cable to your modem or router and wait until all the lights are stable. Then, on your Xbox One console, try to check again if it's now detecting your wireless network. If you have a smartphone, use that to see if your own wireless network is working just fine. Try disconnecting and reconnecting to your Wi-Fi on your phone. If you can connect just fine and internet is working, then the issue is with the Xbox One console. If your console is still not connecting to Wi-Fi or wireless network, you can assume that there's a deeper problem behind it. Unfortunately, there's nothing much that you can do at this point as the rest of the diagnostics has to be performed by a qualified Microsoft technician. What you can do now is to contact Microsoft so you can set up an appointment for repair. Visit Microsoft's Xbox support page if you need to send in your console. That's it. We hope this video is helpful to you. Please subscribe to know our latest videos in the future.